LG teases something hot coming to MWC and we get details on what it might be. Google brings some major discounts to some of its mobile products, and Apple seems ready to bring some more 3D touch enhancements to the iPhone very soon. I'm Jaime Rivera, and if you haven't watched the movie Major League from back in the 80s, I highly suggest you do. This is Spock and Al Daily. The official news today begin with Google as the company has just brought some major discounts to its uh, product portfolio, at least in mobile. If you're interested in products like the Huawei Watch, for example, you can now get it $50 off at the store. And if you're interested in uh, devices like the Nexus 5X, you can also get it with a minor discount. But then again, if you're looking at the Nexus 6P, sadly, that is not on the list. But anyways, these discounts aren't really bad at all. Now, when it comes to teasers, LG has already begun teasing MWC 2016, and this is rather interesting as the company has usually announced its uh, G updates uh, further along during the year, and instead it seems that it might make it to MWC, which is, again, odd for the company. But uh, hey, we even hear rumors that there will be a removable battery on this phone, but that you'll actually be able to slide it from the bottom, sort of like an old HTC phone from back in the day. So stay tuned, this could be hot. Uh, and particularly at a time when the Galaxy S7 will also be announced. And as Lenovo continues to peel the onion when it comes to the future of Motorola, those of you that were worried about the company, we know what will happen for the next two or three years. But then again, we also hear that uh, devices like the Moto G and Moto E aren't going anywhere. If anything, the company is actually going to invest on keeping these devices further because obviously this is part of the product portfolio that actually made Motorola popular over the last few years. So stay tuned. Let's see exactly what these changes might be. Let's move the spotlight over to Apple. Those of you that uh, continue to enjoy 3D Touch up to a certain degree with the iPhone 6S, it seems that the company is bringing more upgrades to it as of iOS 9.3, which already reached beta for developers. Not exactly sure how Apple plans to enhance 3D Touch in the case of third-party developers that haven't still taken advantage of this technology, but uh, hopefully 9.3 might do something about that. And finally, the very interesting rumors of today have to do with the Apple Watch 2 as we hear more about this uh, March event for Apple. It seems that the company is prepping to announce the Apple Watch 2 in addition to the iPhone mini and the iPad Air 3. And it does make a lot of sense as all three devices are actually already dated. They are due for an update. But then again, in the case of the Apple Watch, it does lead me to the question of the day. What would you change from the current Apple Watch that you would like to see on the future model in March? In my case, a persistent always on display, for example, uh, better materials in the case of that IonX glass, which was just terrible at the bottom, and uh, a cheaper price tag. But definitely leave us a comment down below. We'd love to know your opinion. Friends, as always, you know the drill. If you want to get the news earlier before this video was filmed, make sure you follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.